Performance matters. Do you know how your VMware environment and your SVC storage is performing? With BBQ's end-to-end -end performance monitoring solution, you can monitor the VMware environment and the SVC storage in a single view. With BBQ's web interface dashboard, you can have a quick look at the VMware environment. This dashboard shows the ESX hosts, virtual machines, and data stores. It shows the available capacity for all VMs, the allocated capacity to the VMs, and the percentage of allocated capacity. What's great is that you can look at the CPU usage of all ESX hosts, as well as the consumed memory by the VMs in one single view. Another great feature is that with just a click away, you can look at the activity levels of all 200 virtual machines in one single view, not in separate screens. It's important to see the CPU, memory, and I.O. levels for the applications because these requirements can change. BVQ with just one click allows you to see the utilization levels of all 200 VMs and you can compare these from a single view. For example, here we see that one VM has a CPU utilization of 100%. And here we can identify a VM with memory utilization of 98%. The I.O. load requirements and the data stores can also be identified. And this dashboard allows you to choose a specific VM that has been identified with high utilization of resources to look at it in more detail. Then you can add the necessary resources to avoid any performance problems. Another example, by using BVQ's GUI interface, you can quickly identify a VM which could be causing a performance bottleneck on the SVC volume. This view, which is a favorite, shows a tree map. It shows all of the SVC volumes used by VMware. The bigger squares are the MDIS groups or storage pools. The medium squares are the volumes or VDISCs, and in each are smaller squares, which represent the virtual machines that use a particular volume. I select a volume to monitor. The performance of this particular volume is loaded on the views on the right-hand side. The top view shows the volume of redis performance, and the bottom view shows the performance of all the virtual machines that use this volume. We can quickly identify there's a high data rate read and writes spike on a particular virtual machine, and this corresponds to the volume spike in latency, and we have quickly identified the VM which is causing the performance bottleneck on the SVC volume. You can then make a decision to move this virtual machine to another storage so that it does not overload this volume that is used by other VMs. To experience a true end-to-end -end performance monitoring solution on your VMware and Spectrum Virtualized Environment, contact us at svasoftware.com.